our whole group was uh, having a chat over coffee and uh, we were in, in kitchen and we saw we have a Nescafe waste pod where we collect all the waste material. And that's when we thought of, uh, let's find out a solution where rather than sending it to landfills and we can find out a, a solution where we can make this waste as a resource for some application. So the problem with the organic waste going to landfills is basically high uh, methane emissions, which are 21 times worse than carbon dioxide. And then we have to spend a lot of natural uh, our resources to dispose of these waste materials. Coffee in particular, it's about we produce about 75,000 uh, tons per year in Australia, and quite a large amount of it goes into landfills. And this waste is now converted into a resource which provides improvement in strength of the concrete. So the innovation of this project was making this coffee uh, compatible with the concrete, which otherwise is a challenge uh, because of high organic content. So we developed a process where we roasted this in absence of oxygen to a very low energy process uh, to make it compatible with concrete. And we, uh, we managed to improve the strength of concrete by almost 30%. So in addition to making uh, reducing emissions and making a stronger concrete, we are even uh, reducing the impact of uh, continuous mining of natural resources like sand. So this waste can be used as a replacement of that sand, so reducing the impact of uh, continuous mining of sand. Uh, so my name is Shannon Kumar Lynch. I'm a Yoong Inland Balak and Natarak Balak man, and a part of the Tungong people of the Northeast Kulin Nations. Inspiration for my research sort of from an Indigenous perspective plays a lot and involves going back to caring for country, ensuring that there's sort of a sustainable life cycle of all materials, uh, avoid, avoiding things going into landfill and sort of minimising that impact on the environment really plays a big part of, you know, caring for country in itself. And then, so that's really where my inspiration draws from. As an Indigenous coffee roastery, uh, it's important for us to, to lean into key values that align with the coffee industry, but equally that of supporting uh, young Indigenous academics and um, individuals within our community. 